Decorations are up and glowing, but some people really go all out when it comes to the lights. It's like a science for a lot of folks. Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter David McKay is joining us live right now. He's at one home in Granby that is glowing right now for a good cause. Hi, David. That's right. This family on Astor Drive really does it up. It's not just decorating a Christmas tree or putting a wreath on the front door. I mean, they've got lights going up their driveway. And because they have so many people coming out near and far every year, they decided this year to put together something special for a toy drive. The lights come from a festive Brady Bunch off this cul-de-sac. When you see kids look at the lights and they have like this sparkle their eye, it, it, it's kind of it's kind of cool. Scott Roberts has been stringing lights around Christmas for several years, and his fiance and the kids have been helping out. First, it started off with a friendly competition with some community members, and it's just manifested into this. It took four days to string all the bulbs together. I helped out a lot in like helping out design and put everything. Up. I had to climb on the tree. Because of the attention the lights have drawn, Robert's fiance came up with an idea. So we decided it would be nice to do a toy drive. So we decided to do a toy drive for Children's Hospital. My daughter had been to Children's Hospital in the past and gotten toys there when she had surgeries. So far, they've collected about 50 toys. When I was like little, I went to CCMC because they had to do some surgery on my kidneys. But um, they gave me toys every single time I had to go for those surgeries. So I feel like now that I'm done with those surgeries, I think that another kid should get a toy too. Now again, this is on Astor Drive in Granby. They usually leave the lights on until about 10 o'clock at night. If you're asking about the electric bill, I was just told, don't ask. At this point, they're planning on wrapping up the gift giving on December 17th. So if you do come down, bring a gift with you. In Granby tonight, David McKay, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.